What's good ladies and gentlemen, my name is Michael and today we are going to be talking about something that is very sad, okay? This isn't about me, kind of is, but it's also about you. If you're in school, I want you to look at the people you cross, right? On the sidewalk, I want you, or the hallways, or even if you're in work, look at the people who you pass on the way to the printer, or wherever you're at, look at the people around you. I love to do this. Just look at the people around you. What do you see? What do you see in those people? For me, I see people that are sad. And it makes me sad. Right? We're told to put other people first. And we do the best that we can to make everybody happy. But how can you expect to make someone happy if you don't even know what it takes for you to be happy, right? So on one hand, I want to praise you for putting others before you. But on the other hand, I almost want to shame you for it, right? It's foolishness. How can you expect to know what's going to make someone else happy when you don't even know what it takes to make you happy? right? It's, it's ignorant at best. And I see a lot of people that are existing, but not necessarily living, right? And what I mean by that is they seem like they're not happy with their certain circumstance and they're not happy with what they're doing. Therefore, they're in a rut and they're going to stay in that rut. Putting people before you is acceptable if you're willing to take the short and the long term consequences that come along with it. So short term consequence is the time that you give them. The long time consequence is that investment that you could be giving in yourself, giving towards yourself. I always tell people, people hate me for this. Be selfish. Develop yourself. Become the best that you can be, right? We're so focused on getting other people's approval. I made a video on this, so I'm not going to reiterate. I'm not going to, you know, go all into it, but I'll reiterate it. Look at the people that you admire the most, and you'll find that those people aren't trying to get other people's approval because they're too busy trying to get their own approval. How can you expect someone else to like you when you don't even like yourself? But I guarantee you that if you like yourself, if you love yourself, you could find someone else out there that's going to like you and love you, right? Focus on yourself. No one as is, is I'm going to repeat that because this is important. I want this to get through. No one, no one is as important as you are, okay? I don't care if you're homeless, jobless, uh, you got no one left. No one is as important as you. You were put here for a reason. I can't tell you what that reason is. That's up to you to find out, but you have to put yourself first. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, real quick video. I wanted to get this off my chest. I apologize. You can see, you know, the video quality isn't necessarily there. But this is something that's been crossing my mind the last two days. And I figured I just need to start picking up the camera and recording these things. Because the matter of the fact is, I have like a whole list of video ideas. And I say, ah, I'll get, I'll get, a, I'll get to it over the weekend or whatever. But then the weekend, all I want to do is chill because um, I'm, I'm in a varsity sport in college and uh, I wake up. What's oh my up? God. So a lot of you don't know, but I'm actually in a division one sport. So I. Oh, really? <laughs> Dude, come on. <laughs> so I wake up at, you know, 5.30, 6 in the morning. It depends. And then I go to bed at 10 to repeat. Um, so generally on the weekends. I don't get these videos out. I need to start getting them out. Even if the video is sub, uh, subpar, we're going to start getting them out. Stay tuned for the future. Like the video if you did. 
Dislike the video if you disliked it, but comment down below or accidentally hit the like button, whatever, it doesn't matter to me. Uh, also, subscribe for more content. I'll see you in the next video. <sighs>